Version 2.0 completely reworks how the NPC Q-Link knobs function. They are now far more flexible and powerful. These Q-Links can be used as multi-level macro controls for a single pad, a program, or the entire project, and also as a convenient software control system providing quick, direct access to the most important UI facilities. This Q-Link system now works consistently across every MPC mode. You now have the option to view the Q-Links panel within the MPC window in any mode. Your view setups are saved per mode and restored when the software restarts so you can tailor the UI to your particular personal preferences. We've split the Q-Links into five separate scenes that you can quickly switch between using the Q-Links panel or using MPCX hardware buttons. The scenes are screen mode. Here the Q-Links will map to the most useful on-screen controls depending on the MPC's mode. For example, in main mode, you get handy access to parameters governing the metronome, quantization, sequence length, looping, and so on. In the sample editor, you can quickly access sample start, end, and loop points. Pad parameter. This Q-Link mode maps a single user-selectable parameter across all the pads in the current bank. For example, you can choose level to quickly adjust the volume of the pads you're currently playing. Or pan to adjust their stereo position. Pad scene. Here you can pick up to 16 automation parameters and apply them to the current pad. Pick your favorite adjustments, tap a pad, and make real-time edits with a the knob. Then tap another pad to adjust similar values there. Program. This scene allows you to build a custom combination of parameters across an entire program. Here you can refer to any pad parameter, pad insert, program parameter, or program mixer control. As you switch programs, the Q-Link scene flips to the next program with you. Both the pad scene Q-Link mode and the program mode are saved inside each program file and can therefore be reused across many projects. Project. This final scene, saved in the NPC's project itself, allows you to map the Q-Link knobs to any parameter chosen across the entire project. This could be a pad insert, a program parameter, a mixer channel strip control, or any other automatable NPC value. Q-Links can also be mapped using the All New Learn function. To enable Learn, simply press the Learn button on the touchscreen, go to a parameter you'd like to apply the Learn function to, for example, semi on a particular pad, touch the knob to be learned, move the control on the screen, and the parameter is mapped. You can map several parameters in this manner by touching the next control, moving the next control on the screen, and so on. To disable Learn, go back to Q-Link and turn the button off. Alternatively, you can hold down the Q-Link button and select it from there. As you can see, the new MPC Q-Links are a significantly enhanced and much more powerful facility. They make using your MPC faster and more flexible.